Check your fly. The nubbin. This might be the weirdest fly tying tutorial you will ever see. Hey, that's me, casting a fly rod. I am of the opinion that the fly rod is the coolest tool that man has ever invented. And I love to cast them. Sometimes I even invite my buddies over so that we can cast rods out in the yard. I developed a fly to use while practice casting and I call it the nubbin. This is about the easiest fly you'll ever tie. It's got a hook, it's got three aught thread, and it's got deer hair. Let's tie one. This is a Mustad 94840 size 10 dry fly hook. And yes, I grabbed the wrong thread. You stared out this fly with a nice little base of thread there. And then you got to get your deer hair ready. This is some yellow deer hair I have. Cut off a nice thick clump. Maybe pencil diameter or so. And you got to get this ready by getting rid of the under fur and the short hair. So I just uh, hold on to the tips and flap that a few times. Pull those out. Now I take that whole clump and hold it right on top of the hook shank right above my thread nice and tight with my left hand do one nice loose wrap two loose wraps and then i pull it tight and look it explodes all the way around the hook isn't that cool i kind of compact that together with my fingers Okay, my next clump is some green hair, and I do the same thing. Nice, two nice loose wraps. Pull it tight, and oh, my six odd thread broke. You probably saw that coming. We got some three odd on there now for my next clump. Another clump of green hair, two loose wraps. Pull it tight, let go, and it just explodes around the hook. I got room for one more clump of hair on this hook and I'm going to do some more green one loose two loose pull tight let her roll spinning deer hair is pretty cool I'm not very good at it but this is the basics now I'm going to start or get my thread up in front make a nice little thread head there and do my Whip finish. Get that hair out of the way. And done. My nubbin is pretty much done. Here's a yellow one that I tied earlier. All we have left to do is to trim this. And uh, I take it out of the vise to do that. I, you can trim it in whatever si uh, shape you want to. I just usually trim it in a little bullet head type thing. And then all we have left to do is break off that hook point. So I use some pliers to do that. And it's good to go. Check your fly.